from Cheeky Wriggle and Southampton East and we are reading My Big Shouting Room by Rebecca Patterson. Is everybody ready? Are you all sitting comfortably? Yesterday I woke up and Bob was crawling around my room licking my jewellery so I shouted get out of my room and that was the start of my big shouting day. Then I came downstairs and I saw that egg. I cried and cried and I said, I can't eat that. And mummy said, you could eat it last week. Look at Bob eating his mashed banana. After the terrible egg, I decided I didn't like my shoes either. So I took them off all by myself, shouting, no shoes. And then we had to go shopping and mummy said, please stop wriggling Bella. But I couldn't stop wriggling and in the end I shouted, get me out. Mummy said, you will give Bob an earache and you are giving me a headache. And Bob poked me and said, ear. At lunchtime, Sasha and her mummy came to play and, and to have some peanut butter and grapes and a biscuit. But my biscuit broke. Then I couldn't play nicely and I kept saying, no, you can't be princesses. And in the end, Sasha and my mummy and her mummy went home. In the afternoon, it was my ballet lesson. I said, ballet is too itchy. But I was a bit loud and Mrs. Clark stopped playing the piano. And Miss Louisa said, dear, oh dear, perhaps you should sit in the corner then. On the way home, we met the lady who lives next door and she said that Bob was the sweetest thing she'd seen all day. And then she said, and how is Bella? I was a long way behind, so I had to shout, I have a hurting foot. And mummy said, could I keep my voice down? And could I please stop lying on the pavement? What do we have next, everybody? Then it was time for my for my tea and my bath, but those peas were too hot and my bath was too cold. And I was too wet and it was too minty. After that, I rolled and rolled and I said, no bed, no, 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 bed, no, no. And mummy said, well, I think someone needs to go to bed. But I rolled all over the room and then I rolled into Bob's room and I said, bed is for babies. And then I yawned, a little yawn. <sighs> then I crawled into my room and mummy said, who wants a story? And I said, nobody. But she came into my room anyway, and we cuddled up and had my best story about fairies and cakes. <gasps> Ooh. I yawned again, and I said very quietly, today was a big shouting day, mummy. Sorry. And she kissed me goodnight and said, I know, we all have those days sometimes, but perhaps she would be more cheerful tomorrow. And... I was, I was, I was cheerful all day long. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that story about Bella and her big shouting day. Please join me again. Hopefully we'll be back very, very soon. But for now, bye from Tonya from Jiggies and bye from Bella and my big shouting day. Bye.